There it goes. Where's the tier 8? It's a kid economy. Alright. I knew that was holding it up. Because if you have one guy and then a bunch of one tier below it and a tier below that, it's like, wait. What do you do? Kid economy is trash boat. 4x guns. They're shitty guns. Hey, no, I'm meaning my guns. What are you talking about? Oh, the Kitakami. Oh, yeah, no. It's garbage. Here we have it's the really King garbage. George. You got him. It's a boat. Bit. I've not played the King George before, but it's got a lot of guns. You're just compensating for something, that's all. I don't understand why with two 4x turrets, it then needs hey. a random 2x turret. Come here, you. Whoa. Let me show you how many guns I've got. Oh, my. That's like a real American. You're learning. You ready Is for that this? two planes or one? In, in on your uh, Brooklyn. Yeah. It's two planes. Still better. Now. This thing has a fast reload time. Oh my goodness. Like twenty seconds now, or so. If it's like the real King George, one of your front turrets will jam and then you'll be useless for the rest of the battle. That's not very nice. Why does it look like my ship could fold in half? Oh, because of the cranes? Yeah, yeah, well, I mean, yeah, and the, the spar. Or, <laughs> yeah. I guess it's life rough, but it looks like you could just fold this thing in half. Anyways. Yeah. Man, it looks like they could have fit another turret or two on this thing even. Not that it would, you know, stay floating, but it could have happened. Who needs historical realism? And there's the alternate ship, the Nelson. One less turret. Oh, they have a DD. I did not know oh. That. Yeah, it would have been good to see. If the base got no camo. Approaching shard. Let's assume the shard's not actually dropping speed despite launching smokes. Excellent. I assumed right, he's down 2300 health. I don't know, I've never actually played this ship prior to just now. Give me a little bit. That reload time, though, good lord. Let's go. Good view. Talk. Okay. Shots on Sharn. Oh, I just need to back up. Actually, I don't need to move forward. Excellent. Good. Uh, six or three off Sharn. Kind of like a Pennsylvania. Ah, uh, it'll aim accurately at destroyers and that kind of thing because of the 4x turret. Nine hundred off the Nelson. What the fuck is the kid economy doing? Kid economy. No, it's I don't not. Know. <laughs> oh, I can't find it. Did he disconnect? Oh. Wait, did you not pen a Kitakami? Not of HG. Oh, okay. Never mind. That's fine. It's like, good lord, man. What are you firing at it? Let's see how this thing does. I've got a uh, naval Teuton up. Just need vision. Come on. Come on. 
I didn't even see a hipper. That's not bad. Once again, the German battleships had made me forget that I have planes. Right. Let's go. Fly over and check it out. We almost had it. Need more shells in there simultaneously. The enemy warships yeah. over. Kill his frame rate and his boat. <laughs> it's not enough to just kill him. We also need to make him lag at the same time. That dude must be so pissed right now. <laughs> and he's dead. Oh, wow. I reloaded to AP, but it didn't count somehow. Oh. And so I ran out of HE. <laughs> That's how I'm doing that salvo. <laughs> I hate when that happens. This is a nice fast ship. I'm running it with an armor mod and it's going 26 knots and it's not uh, upgraded. I think um, you like King George V? It's a nice boat. Although now that I've got 100% win rate in it, I, I can never play it again. No. Uh. Yeah. I don't know. This thing does have a very nice reload. Torpedo incoming! Evasive maneuvers! Whoa, what the fuck, man? What's going on over there? I'm going fishing! If you go back, there's a couple of fish, I'm sure. <clears throat> yeah, King James... No. No, King George also has the, uh... Scout plane, so that is nice. <clears throat> it's faster, has a scout plane. It doesn't have as much AA, but I believe it's AA is stronger per shell? I think? I'm curious if they're actually going to add in the shotgun AA, or salvo AA for shot. We'll find out in 24. Yeah, because there is a patch up coming. Anyways, that was a stock KGV match with random banter because I didn't plan any of it. Uh, <clears throat> let's give you a momentary. Someone posted this in the thread. I'm gonna guess. Let you guess who it is. No squad. Stare at Issei Stern trying to work up the effort to solo queue. <laughs> that face win. It's just a sad bear. Or no bar. The Royal Navy designed the King George V-class battleships while mistakenly believing that the London Naval Treaty would limit their main artillery of new battleships to 14 inches. These ships featured the same structures as the Nelson class, but with a standardized superstructure and improved side armor. I'm buy some one, Pokemons. one of the three good luck. One of the three quad gun turrets was changed to a double gun turret to reduce weight. The ships of this class took part in many World War II battles. Prince of Wales damaged the German battleship Bismarck in her, first, in her first voyage, but was hit twice in the battle. Late in 1941, she was sunk in a Japanese air attack in Malaysia, and the Duke of York seriously damaged and sunk battleship Scharnhorst in the Battle of oh, the Northern... Oh, let me let you answer this guy's stupid question. Northern Cape. Let you type out your... That's the King George. It was a neat little ship. How'd I do? Yeah, he's got zero battles. He was asking yeah. like half an hour ago. 